Hello people, I'm Vito and welcome to Wario Land Shake It with Robberlink. Hello, we are here with one of the most popular games of all time. You can't go anywhere on the internet without hearing about this. It's so famous. <laughs> it is absolutely peak, as they say. Yes. <laughs> all right, so actually this is a game we've never played before, uh, but it was recommended by a friend who just, you know, said... Here, you can have the disc. I don't know if it's to lend or to keep, but either way, I guess we'll play it. I have never played a Wario game before. I believe Robber Link has, though, right? You had, what was it? Wario, Wario Land. It might have been. Or no, Wario World? Yeah, it was on GameCube. I remember seeing you play a bit of it. Yes. And uh, from what my friend who lent me this said, apparently that one was uh, kind of weird, according to them. Would that be accurate? Well, I suppose, but it's the only Wario game I played, so I have nothing else to compare it to. <laughs> I've played no Wario games. Who's this girl? I have no idea. <laughs> so naturally, we have no idea what's going on or what we're going to be doing. Fun, right? Yay. Is this voiced or no? It doesn't sound like it. It's a little quiet. With every shake, a fortune in coins bursts forth from its limitless depths. Now both this legendary treasure... And... Who's this girl? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, where did you come from? This enchanting young queen... Belong to me. Ha! Huh. Even disdain is lovely on this face. Shake Dimension, tremble before your new king. This artifact will definitely have no negative impact on the economy. My beloved queen, don't worry. I will rescue you. Somehow. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Proceeds to leave. <laughs> that was going to dive off. <laughs> Actually, never mind. <laughs> I give up. So many characters. And no names. Oh, I remember this. Oh, yeah, the Wario car. It was in Double, Double Dash. Dash. Yeah. Hello, package for Mr. Wario. Wario, a little present from me to you. The real treasure is inside. Enjoy. <laughs> Looked like he was just going to walk off like, no, I don't care. <laughs> you woke me up. Now I'm mad. <laughs> me I wake up and choose violence. Please, you must save her. See, this terrible pirate, the Shake King, he attacked us. He invaded our home, the Shake Dimension. I managed to get away, but all my dear friends were captured. And then that brute stole the Shake Dimension's greatest treasure. <laughs> treasure? And yes. It's a magic sack that never runs out of coins, no matter how often you shake it. Mm, uh, how do you get to the shake dimension? Uh, you can get there through this telescope. How convenient. But without the help of my captured friends, you'll be stuck in there, stranded in my world. You'll help us, right? Then let's go. Follow me. It's like, he thinks I'm going to help, but I'm just going to steal the treasure. Is what I imagine he's thinking. Most relatable protagonist ever. <laughs> <laughs> In it for the money, not the glory. So what I've heard about some of the previous Wario Land games, I don't know if this one is 2D or not, but it has a lot of like mobility stuff and you have to get to the end of the level and then find your way back after it's changed. And I heard that that's what inspired 
a recent game called Pizza Tower. Huh. I've seen a bit of that. And yeah, there's like wall, you can like run up walls if you have enough momentum, you can bash through things. And then while you're running up a wall, you can jump off and huh. do a few other things. And it does look like this is 2D, okay. Mr. Wario, welcome to the shake dimension. I don't want to have to shake the controller, please no. <laughs> no, it's just called that because um, we get a lot of earthquakes. We're on the sea. I guess that means tsunamis then. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> oh dear. Prepare to suffer. <laughs> Captain Syrup. Hmm. Hold on there just a moment now. Our greatest treasure, the bottomless coin sack, has been stolen. Stolen by a vicious pirate known as the Shake King. Like, uh, why do you need it? Why didn't you just shake it enough that you were satisfied with what you had and then just said, here, you can have it for a while now. <laughs> Can't you share? <laughs> just get it, you know, yeah, get it like a timeshare for the thing. <laughs> but don't get your long johns in a twist. I have a way to find the Shake King. First, you'll have to beat the bosses, who rule the five continents of this here world. Gosh, I almost forgot, Mr. Wario. You'll need to collect the five boss emblems. Without those, we can't find the Shaking's ship. I mean, you were on it. Couldn't you place, like, a tracking device? <laughs> no. Darn. <laughs> That's where, I, where my queen, Queen Marilda, is being held against her will. Please, Mr. Wario, I beg you, save Queen Marilda. So in other words, wherever this Queen Marilda is, we should also find the bottomless coin sack, get me? So what do you think, Wario? Think you can handle it, handsome? Wait, so is she from this world? But, but wait then. Or had she just already been briefed? I don't know. <laughs> we would probably need to play the previous games to know if she's a recurring character. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I was also expecting to have to voice Wario or something, so I was letting you voice these two. <laughs> but now it seems like you're just going to be voicing these two for a very long time. Eh. <laughs> I mean, you're the one playing the game. Gives me something to do. I suppose. Excellent. Now that that's decided, let's not waste any more time. Why don't we warm up by grabbing the treasure off this ship? <laughs> I can have your treasure? No, this isn't my ship. <laughs> Uh, you can handle this yourself, huh? Trying to hog all the treasure, eh? Oh, yeah. If that's how you want it, for the moment, we'll split up. <laughs> Mr. Wario, if you save my friends, I'm sure they will be of help along the way. Mm. Careful, though, Wario. Once you've rescued... <laughs> I also captured. <laughs> <laughs> Once you've captured your friends... <laughs> Once you've captured... Um, rescued a Murphle, get back fast. If you don't return to the starting gate fast enough, you won't be able to take the treasure you found with you. Okay, so yeah, this is that mechanic. Well then, I'll leave it to you. See you around, handsome. Good luck! So my understanding is when I get to that end point, certain things about the level will change, which will probably require that I take a different path to get to the end, or beginning, I guess. Who knows? Anyway, off to, um... Who knows where? <laughs> I was gonna say, like, off to, uh, yeah. conquer five entire continents, I guess. All to find a single boat. <laughs> I can do, like, belly flops, apparently, if I'm crouching. Interesting. Yeah, the, uh, Wario World game I played was, uh, 3D, so... Yeah. Okay, apparently my bash does nothing to that. So those red blocks before, I wonder if that's something that will change when I get to the end. Hmm. Also, I don't know... There might have been like a way to pick up enemies or something. What about this one? I know it's not the one you wanted me to do. Murphle Syrup. Hmm. Wait. <laughs> that woman I saw before, they put her in this bottle? <laughs> How does that work? Well, I see. It's like baby shampoo. <laughs> Made from... <laughs> Fresh babies, yes. Precisely. 
Uh, what? What did I do? You're shaking the whole ship, Wario. Sorry, I just... Yeah, we just started this after playing a Castlevania game, and I'm expecting to have double jump, and I do not. And it's throwing me off a bit. <laughs> do I have to... Okay, no. I thought I had to double press down for some reason. It wasn't working before, at least not consistently. But it's working now. That seems safe. <laughs> nothing, <laughs> nothing bad could possibly happen now. Okay, so I can transfer that by jumping. All right. Uh, here comes the shaking. Uh. Yay. <laughs> You're just carrying it with you. Yeah, I wanted to pick up the, the rest of the coins first. Uh. Whoop. What the <laughs> heck was that? What <laughs> did you do? Was that just from shaking without anything? Yeah, I guess so. I don't... I don't know how useful that is. Will that clear the screen? Maybe? Huh. Ah, uh, this is using the tilt. Well, that didn't work. Uh. <laughs> Frickin' work! So I have to just go undershoot it? No. <laughs> there we go. Okay. It's a little annoying. When it doesn't want to work the way I want it to. All right. Six week old curry. Yum. <laughs> Is this a weapon? <laughs> Saguario, no, no, don't eat that. That is for the enemies. So, whoops, I thought I still had the uh, the ball, so I pressed the button. Nope. I was going to fling it at them. You could say you uh, dropped the ball on that one. <laughs> I suppose so. Okay, that works. Die. Get impaled. <laughs> Get footstooled and impaled, I guess. Wait, what? Okay, so I guess it's just saying to whoop, do that. <laughs> Come on. Hello. <laughs> Hold him in the worst possible place. What if I do it now? Oh, I'm just shaking him instead. Oh. Huh. Was that health? Yeah. <laughs> Give me more. <laughs> Give me freaking more. <laughs> okay, fine. Okay, so that stuns them, so that I don't need to kill them, I guess? Oh. At least that's what I'm assuming. Do you have more? But can you kill them, though? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well. Okay, so it's... Yeah, that's what I found out before. Okay. Hi, you're my friend now. <laughs> Did you just make monkey noises? I'm not sure. Um, I wonder if that's an onion that he drops. Because that, that was a thing, right? I remember in one of the Smash games, you could go on, I think it was Brawl, you could go on the, the Metal Gear Solid map and you could get a briefing about a character. Yeah. And I think it was like, Wario loves onions or something like that. Or garlic. It was garlic. I was going to say, I know in Wario Land you regained health by eating garlic. Okay, so I guess I need to actually use the jump to be able to... Oh, wait, no. Maybe, like... There we go. Yeah. Before it wasn't working the way I intended. Hello. Garlic. Thank you. I probably didn't need that. Yeah, you don't... You don't need it anymore. You're just doing it out of spite. <laughs> hmm. What does this do? I assume you enter it. Oh, okay. It didn't seem to work before. Oh, I wasn't looking at the background thing. Yeah, I, I remember something like that being uh -huh. in what I saw of Pizza Tower, where you can have, like, a sustained charge and do things with it. 
Okay then. Why is it not working? There. <laughs> See, it seems a little inconsistent. Oh, do I have to slide here then? Well, it didn't give me a choice. Okay then. Fickle compass. That seems so useful. <laughs> Makes me think of Pirates of the Caribbean. What was it? It like points towards what you want or something? Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, nope. Stop that. Oh, big garlic. I'm sorry, you seem to be dead now. <laughs> <laughs> well, dispose of the corpse. Yeet. Yes, I've learned how to do this game. <laughs> Got anything else? Nope. <laughs> then screw you. Dang. Yeah, it's really convenient that this uh, random ship we're on uh, happens to have an entire, like, instructional training course built inside of it. <laughs> I don't know if I was supposed to keep the charge all the way up to here, but oh well. I guess not. Like here I see in the background behind me, they oh, look okay. like block spaces. Oh, is this the thing? Yeah. See, now it changed that. Huh. Oops. You fool! <laughs> I'm slow now! Hmm, five minutes. It didn't seem like enough, you know? <laughs> yeah, we barely made it out. Like, how are you supposed to do that? Oh, so those are, those are like bonus missions? I don't know if I... I guess? Oh yeah, it looks like I got enough coins. Alright. Yay! crown. You've completed all the missions in Aboard the Sweet Stuff. Is that the ship's name? I can only assume so. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> okay. Mission complete, right? That was a fun little distraction. <laughs> It's like, no, no, wait, you need to save people. I already got the money. <laughs> huh, media room. I hear the Wii working. <laughs> Angry beeping. <laughs> huh, interesting. All right, then. Is that saying there's another part here? Yeah, okay. I think. Because that's what I completed, right? Yeah. I think so, yeah. So now that we've plundered your ship. <laughs> this is definitely your ship, right? Welcome, Wario. Come on in. Since you won't be needing me on your trip, I'm opening a pirate shop. To celebrate our grand opening, I'll give you a special deal on area map number one. A pirate shop? That sounds a little bit of... like an oxymoron? A little bit. <laughs> also, wait, aren't we both after infinite wealth? What? <laughs> why do I have to... Why are you making me pay for anything? Like, is this in case I fail? If you have that little faith in me? I want a, a piece of your infinity. <laughs> Put it on my infinite tab. <laughs> Pretty much, hopefully. Welcome aboard, handsome. Be sure to look for my special deals. Huh, maps. I have, or not have. I hear the remains of an ancient culture rest here. Feeling brave, handsome? The plains here stretch as far as you can see. Care to take a look-see? Is this like a, just a background map to look at? Or is this actually unlocking the areas? I do not know. Oh well, I can plenty afford that. So Thanks, handsome. This lets you view the opening movie anytime you want. 
we could just restart the game or start a new file. Jeez. <laughs> Plus, I've recorded it. <laughs> so, ha. Darn capitalist pirates. <laughs> Monetizing everything. Hmm. It could be useful, but I don't think I can afford that. All right, so that's about it for now. Yeah, I think that's okay. That's what's expected. No, it's not okay. How could you think this is okay? <laughs> Usually you only need confirmations on things that are, you know, irreversible. <laughs> no, you want to leave the shop? Are you sure? This could, this could completely change the course of the game. <laughs> Uh, no, the secret is that, uh, that was the only time you could visit the shop. <laughs> the truth is you have to, uh, replay the tutorial level, like, a several thousand times to get enough money to unlock the entire map. <laughs> Alright, so I guess it does unlock. Yeah, okay. It's Stone Carving City. Should be easy for you. Finish before... Two hours? <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then jump off three in a row. I don't know if I'm yeah, I don't know if I'm going to go after those immediately, specifically, but maybe. If I remember. Given your history of uh one hundred percenting. It depends on the game. Yeah, fair enough. Oh yeah, this thing. So I wonder if the the mission is just referring to um, finishing on the way back before it's too late. Oh, maybe. Because there is no timer here. No, die. Freaking die. <laughs> I'm glad it threw it faster that time than like I wanted. <laughs> Somehow the game knew. So I'm supposed to jump on like three of these in a row, right? Are there three? I don't see three. Not here. Or can I just do it like this? I'm assuming there's going to be three in a row later. Hmm. Whoop. Whee! Give me that. Oh, dang it. No! They've disappeared. Um, how do I get up there then? Unless. Oh, could you jump on them to do it or? Oh, oh, nearly killed myself there. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Because that doesn't seem to go high enough. Huh. Is there a way to build up speed? Like a lot of speed? I don't know. <laughs> Interesting, they don't seem to hurt. They're, they just exist. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to think. How would I do this? Yeah, I, I wasn't able to dash. Whoops. Okay, apparently that's not a good thing to do. <laughs> Bash the treasure chest. Or chest. Bag? Yeah, bag. Kill me. I have failed. <laughs> oh, it doesn't even hurt you. Yeah. Huh. Here, can I actually do... There we go. Yeah, no, that's not good enough. Sorry, I don't know how to do this. <laughs> I may just have to skip it. Looks like there's an area above you, so maybe you come back? Like, from above? Is that a thing? I don't know. <laughs> what? <laughs> Thanks. That's right, I don't actually need health, and that seems to be the only thing they give. So I can stop wasting time with that. Die. What about you? Because you're a different color. Gold? 
Well, you're freaking worthless. <laughs> Rude. Yeah, no, I guess this is where it would have to let out. I assume. Hmm. So I guess it's not. And I just missed it. Oh, wait. My bad. I missed something. Another thing, rather. Whoop. Oh. <laughs> I thought I could start a dash in midair, but I could not. Whoop. Excuse me. Really? Okay, there <laughs> you go. go. Nice. Oh, yeah, now you won't let me get up there? <laughs> Friggin' timing. Next room. There's two of them. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'm not really adding much commentary. I just... I'm just trying to figure out how to get up higher. Maybe if I bring one of you... Excuse me. I need you for a sec. No, that doesn't seem like enough. Like, how am I supposed to do this? Does this give me speed? No. It's not steep enough. Can you throw him at the block to destroy it? Maybe. Whoops. Like, what was that tilt aim thing you could do? It only gave me that option with the ball. Oh. What if I shake you first and then throw? No. There's well, the how one. Do you, how do you get it to. Yeah, oh. that. I don't know what caused that. Was Wasn't it, because... it tilting? Uh, for the ball, yeah. Okay, it's holding it. Okay, there we go. Where's the other one? <laughs> okay. We're figuring it out. You. Get back here. I need you. <laughs> Yeah, I thought it would only work with the ball. I, I seem to remember seeing the aerial show up earlier for like a moment when you were holding them. So I was like, it, can you throw them as well? Yeah, but that still leaves that entire path up there. So I don't know if that's what I was supposed to do. Full body goggles? Bit weird. <laughs> you know, for when you need goggles for your arms, your legs, your torso, everything. So that they can see. Oh. What, you don't let your body see? You know, I never really considered that. <laughs> That's my bad. You're so cruel to your body. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> see, now that works. Just don't know how to do with some of the other areas. Yeah, I can't push that apparently. Oop. What is this? Oh, it's a checkpoint. Okay. Huh. So, do I want to push this? Will this kill me? <laughs> hmm. Can I? No, I cannot dash and then crouch. That works. Oh. Okay, so Ooh. I can use that to get higher, right? I think I saw a chest up there. Okay, I'm, I'm just not sure which way is forward. Uh, Maybe the arrow? Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I didn't see an arrow till now, though. Uh. Um, here. There we go. <laughs> I wonder, could there be anything hidden over here? Nope, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> Never mind. Oh well. I don't care enough. <laughs> so it seems best to do this like towards the wall, maybe, or maybe not. <laughs> Generally, yeah. And 
I wanted to say generally and in general at um, the same time. Maybe that's what I need him for. Whoops. <laughs> that's not the thing that stuns him. Never mind then. <laughs> Can I, like, leave the room and come back to make him respawn? Maybe. Probably not. I don't know. Warning, intruder alert. I don't care. Oh yeah, the thing has an arrow. Get me out of here. Oh yeah, see? Oh. This is back to there. I was right. Or, oh wait. I can't freaking dive. Well, you failed. Can I die and try again? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> this seems kind of far away. Mm. You know, when you're not taking your time to understand how to hit things. I mean, just or to get the time, even if I was still speeding around. Ah. Uh. Oh, well. <laughs> Interesting game. Hmm. Whoopsie desert. <laughs> The place where people have accidents, I assume? It's right next to the uh, Doopsie Desert. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, the Doopsie Pit or something. Where people fall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they have the whoopsie, and it leads to a doopsie. You know how it goes. <laughs> Alright, well, it has been about 30 minutes, so I think we will end this episode here. And we will continue this next time. So, dear viewers, goodbye. For now. Goodbye.